What's up guys? This morning we're gonna push Platinum Arena again. I haven't prepared, I'm not like one hour in advance pushing like some of those super strong cons. I'm only gonna do a 30 minute push. Sometimes I feel like I should do a little bit more, sometimes a little bit less. But the issue is if I if I push way too long and I get super high and there's plenty of time left, my defense is just gonna get absolutely blown up by the top accounts anyway. So I have to kind of take that into account. But we're pretty much just gonna spam Narses and Arman's offense and gonna try to avoid speed teams and that kind of stuff. So I think I have to avoid most of the teams that I meet, but the teams that I can battle, I'm just pretty much gonna like uh, blow up easily and fast, but we will see how far it gets me in the current meta. Not not as far as Vogot and Rector. Rector Daft got me back in the day for sure. Okay, we're starting out 16 points below Platinum. Oh, I actually got a win in defense. That's cool. My defense used to get tons of wins back in the day, but uh, nowadays it doesn't. That's what I'm gonna go with. I haven't really made any adjustments in a while. I don't think I have anything much better to do than this, but... Except I should put the Protoss before UDK in the team order, just so that if both Rotos and UDK are dead and Ankara is alive, she's gonna revive my Rotos and not UDK. Just a little detail, but let's make that happen. Anyway, as you saw my Narciss build just now, I purposely made him slower. Okay, th this was just a meme team. Th this is my actual team. I purposefully made my Narciss just now slower than it normally is. Normally I run like 240 something speed Narciss for live arena. Right now I have it at 180 speed. It did get more damage, but um, I also just want it to be slower, even if it isn't that much more damage. I mean, it is, but the, my normal build probably is um, on paper better. But uh, there's a lot of stone skin and reaction going on, and uh, we want to hit hard and one-shot the enemy, so we're gonna go with this. As you can see right now, most people are running some kind of uh, speed threat. By speed threat, I mean like CC champion that is built fast and is gonna CC and lock you out or something if you don't go before them. Maybe we can beat this team, but this also can can be a bit rough. Okay, let's go for it. By the way, it's super nice in that sense that uh, now I don't have to like double check everybody's name to see if they are clan mate. That sometimes can be a little bit annoying. But yeah, people are mostly running lockout in defense as speed threat right now. But um, it could be something like Armands or some other options as well. Okay, I kind of knew that was gonna happen, but I, it's better to use the AoE anyway. Yeah, because because of this. I mean, I have my Ankara in stone skin, and. If we manual it, we can just revive the Narsus with cooldowns back. Yeah, okay, we're good. It kind of looked a little bit scary, but we actually got a good time in that battle. Okay, I think we can just out this. I just woke up. Um, I'm a little bit allergic. Give me a sec. Just on weekend, my um, like my parents and my brother and his girlfriend, they were visiting me and they had a cat. I like cats, but the cats kill me with their um, whatever it's called, with their straws, with their hair, with their hair. Yeah. Anyway, still recovering from that after a day. 
But yeah, I kind of talked about this a little bit in, I guess, a video that isn't released yet, but will, I'm sure, be released this week. Maybe in a couple of videos I had with other people, actually, but yeah, the meta isn't like it used to be. I mean, I've, I think it's a good thing that the meta changes, but uh, I've, I wish it would change a little bit more often. It kind of used to back in the day and now we're kind of back in the speed meta which isn't exactly my fourth day as you might assume the, the narcissist offense is strong don't get me wrong i mean if i see defense teams that are not speed teams i can blow them up like i wasn't able to before like taras would be very hard to deal with without narcissist well i guess i can still lose but i'm Generally pretty okay. I got a little bit life harvest there. But the issue is that at the same time my defense is getting absolutely hammered and basically can't get any wins against anybody. <laughs> and it didn't used to be like that. I used to have actually... My defense used to be what carried me in classic arena, not offense. Like I used to have like slow and reliable offense battles but they were way slower than other people but there used to be some gimmicks that i was able to pull off where my defense was really strong and and got caught people off guard and i had like sometimes very highly positive win ratios uh, can we I, i'm kind of scared to hit this team with harm my uh, i'm gonna lack damage Okay, this one looks scary, but we're gonna go for it. I had this one reset where I had uh, 16 wins in defense and and two losses. So I had like 90% win ratio. And it wasn't like random people. It was like the IPR top people with multiple trophies just losing to my defense. And I got ranked 3. And that's that's long time ago, but... Uh, there has been times when, um, like during that time, um, not everybody was using Mitral in defense, but Mitral was kind of, I don't want to revive the Armands just because I don't want to waste it. Mitral was kind of meta, not, not like, not, not like Taras, everybody didn't use Mitral, but there was other people using Mitral as well, not just me, and I used to run like, uh, ultra high resistance mitrala because the top accounts they were running um ramantu with lady kimi and they were basically like doing the buff strip i think they were running like ramantu ramantu lady kimi warlord and anuker Th that was the like the, the there was some variations but that was the like the speed meta offense for the top people but i had so high resistance on my mitrala who was in like perception and I was actually using Mitral Aura, which some people thought was a troll, but it was actually a big brain play. But I had so high resistance on my Mitral that those people actually most of the time couldn't uh, buff strip her or lock her out, even with uh, accuracy buff. And yeah, the top, top people like they fought me, they thought it I got lucky, like it was a mistake, they lost it. Then they did it again, and then they were like, oh fuck, he actually resisted me, and then, then they lost again. And some people even, like, um, went for <laughs> went for third third try, just to see if, if they got, like, 3% advice, but, yeah. Those were the days. Nowadays, my defense is like, um, anybody can beat it, so. And it's not just that anybody can beat it, but that's not really, like, uh, it would be fine if there was some other... Uh, I mean, there's no strategies to come up with. That, that's the thing. Like, I complain about the same kind of stuff all the time, but... Uh, nice, we got the block revive. But there's just not... Right now, there's not really much different than I could do. The Rot Rotos thing is the best to go. We're having a super lo long fight now. Well, as long as we don't get any losses, it's okay. What 
Okay, we're 261. What's the rank for top 20? It's like uh, 250, so we will need like 150 points. But we're not gonna be able to. I, uh, theoretically, we could potentially do it, but it's not possible. I'm not gonna have that. We're gonna have some slow fights like that one. Should we do the R base team? I feel like we can do it with Narsis. Also, I know I've been saying that I'm gonna stream the uh, Classic Arena. There's, <laughs> there's always so much stuff for me to do when I think I'm gonna take my time to set up the stream. I'm like, I'm pretty sure next time it's gonna be streamed though. Th this one is on video. Next week it's gonna stream. I was like, like I said, there was so much st stuff going on one weekend. I did a bunch of videos and my family was visiting me. like. Just before they visited me and afterwards, I did like super long collabs with other people, like two hour collabs or... <laughs> I think we did like three or four hour collab with Rock. Anyway... Um, I was planning to... That's why I didn't even have a video on Sunday. I was planning to set up the stream on Sunday, but it didn't happen. That's still my plan. I, I will stream resets from now on. I'm not gonna make videos. I might do both of them, but I'm gonna stream it. That's the plan. And I'm gonna do other content on YouTube. So, anyway. I, I'll need to do a uh, best stream. I should do a couple streams this week. We will see. Ah, uh, that if he looks so tanky. I don't think I can block revive it. Oh, I could. Okay. I'll take it. Let's just get rid of the R base to... Um, so he doesn't do anything. I would rather... It's much better to manual these fights, but... Uh, I kind of have to... I mean, out of these fights, it's so much faster, but I kind of have to... Um, have to do this right now. Okay, we, I mean, we got this, but it, two minutes is a bit slow. Ideally, it would be like one minute. This it took a bit too long time. I don't think my defense is going to take this long time for other people. Anyway. Let's focus on quick battles. By the way, you, you might... Uh, you might notice that I basically never done any collabs, like a couple, like in the span of like a year, but um, I may have like, I already did two, two this weekend, and spoiler, or, spoiler alert, I did two more, they just aren't published, <laughs> so uh, don't be surprised if you see that, I'm kind of, I don't want to do like trillion coll collabs in like row, and then not do any of them for like year but it kind of happened um, kind of accidentally uh, but I'm gonna try to like um, hit stutter not stutter stacker them I'll try to stacker them in future but now now there was a bunch of collapse in short span of time or I guess two of them are not released yet but probably this week so but <laughs> actually I've been working on a lot of content even though uh, even though there wasn't a video on Sunday, but I have, so. And I, I thought the videos with noobs and rats were kind of interesting. I'm kind of surprised that the video with noobs was not very popular, but um, probably the fault is my thumbnail. I was kind of experimenting on that and letting Letting somebody else um, dictate uh, dictate the thumbnail, but I should have just gone with my basic stuff. Even though my my crappy Photoshop art isn't perfect, but um, it does the job. I need to refine it, but it does the job. So okay, 
Okay, I, I don't know what rank we're gonna get today. I kind of want to get a good rank, but I kind of feel like... Maybe again, I... I, like I said at the start, I don't want to do too early push, but maybe I should have done like 5 minutes more or something like that. But yeah, I'm avoiding like every single thing with lockout or armaments. The thing with those is that obviously if you are faster than them, those teams can still be super good. But right now because Nars is being able to blow up teams with shield there isn't really like any reason to like you're not able to pull off super tanky teams like you used to in the past so everyone is just running a lockout anyway it's kind of weird meta but um so it's kind of weird actually i think i'm just gonna go for um no nah, okay we're still gonna open with a2 it's a weird meta that on paper i have a super strong offense right now but in practice, it's not really doing much. Ah, too bad I wasn't able to bar strip the UDK, or I mean, polymorph it. My offense is strong, the Ankara is amazing when you can use it, but if everybody's, <laughs> if everybody's using a lockout, then I'm kind of screwed. Anyway, let's go for auto a bit more. I should have done auto, but I didn't. There was some fights that looked kind of dicey, and I didn't want to risk it. But here we still have the Ludia passive left anyway, so let's just now we save to auto. Yeah, maybe I made some fights slightly slower than was necessary, just because I was kind of scared to lose. I had like a couple weeks of break from bushing just because all sorts of stuff, so one week my computer was broken, another week I was sick, another week I was just too too tired to uh, wake up in time. Okay, now somebody hit me in defense, goddamn. It's okay. I'm, I'm gonna hit it. I, I was getting good offers from CHQ to join their clan. Pretty sure I'm gonna turn them down in order to make my own clan. But they were they were really good offers. I was. I mean, it's it's still not like totally like um, we'll see what happens. But um, probably I'm gonna go with my own clan. But uh, CHQ definitely was a good option as well. I mean, uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say about that. It was pretty cool. Many people were very, uh, like, kind of uh, <laughs> kind to show their, like, uh, like sympathies. Many people were, like, inviting me to join their clan. I wasn't exactly, like, trying to, like, uh, <laughs> like, um, guilt trip sympathy, but I guess, uh, it just kind of happened that way, but it, it was nice anyway, so... But yeah, uh, CHQ was a really good option, I, w I was thinking about it a lot. I don't want to bully Chasa, but that's what we're gonna do. This is kind of like back in the old days. I Maybe I should make a video about it if I can find the old clips, but it kind of used to be a meme. And to be clear, I'm, I'm very friendly termed in friendly terms with Chasop, so don't like misunderstand me, but um, Chasop used to be kind of like me, that during the meta where I was very competitive, he was as well, and uh, that was during the Cupidus meta, to be clear. Not, not that I had Cupidus, but I was able to farm the Cupidus, Cupidus teams and I had really good defense back in those days, but um, Chasop used to hit me like very often, and then he was always surprised by my defense. And at one time there was like, I'm pretty sure it was like a month in a row that on every single reset he hit me. And it's always on like stream or video, both. Or like, I think it was like four, four months or like four weeks in a row, a month. He hits me once every reset and then he like 
loses it or barely loses it, but he loses it every time. <laughs> and he's like, okay, this time I'm gonna win. And then they, he loses it every time. And then I had like a French uh, weaver who always like linked me, <laughs> linked me the battle of uh, of uh, Chasha losing to me. And then I was posting it to him or something like that. I don't recall exactly, but I was trolling him a little bit. But I'm very familiar with Chasop because he, he has been pushing actively for like a very long time, so he's one of those very active bat pushers. He also... What? Oh my god. How many defense losses did I take? Holy moly. What? We took like 10 losses in like 2 minutes. Okay. We're out of plot. I didn't see that coming. We were doing fine and then we're out. Okay, this is kind of risky. I could lose this battle, but maybe we can do it. Do a fast one. Damn. I guess this is where the meta is at. I wasn't expecting. It was going so well. And then I'm just complete. I was like rank 200 or maybe 150 at that point, And boom, I'm in gold 4. Wow. Well, I I can't. Um, I mean, this has definitely happened to me before. Not not in a while though. But um, are we actually gonna finish Cold for? I don't remember last time that this has happened, but it definitely has happened. I mean, it might be like two, three years ago since it happened, but it it has happened to me. But yeah, like. I've been having a hard time lately, but not this hard time. I mean, I haven't like dropped the gold. Usually I'm like rank 50 or rank, let's say like somewhere between rank 50 and 150. Uh, I don't know about the Mikaki defense. Okay, I think yeah, we, we can beat this. Yeah. Now we're kind of in a rush. There's only like seven minutes left. So now I just need to... <laughs> Didn't rush to finish anywhere in the Platinum. Never mind, like, high ranks. Oh, he doesn't have... Did he have... I didn't pay attention. Did he have Rotos uh, UDK in Immunity? Or what set? But it wasn't in Stone Skin, at least. Might have been in Immunity. Some people run Immunity, immunity set on UDK in order to counter bombs, which are kind of popular on the higher rankings. It's very risky, but it's very fast if you can pull it off. Should watch my video with rats. We were talking about bombs during that as well. Rats was kind of saying that, I mean, I knew about it, of course, but we kind of went into detail, like how rats was at one point, or like when he was playing raid, he was basically winning every other reset, like multiple times a month, he was getting ranked one. And it's not like other mad people didn't want to beat him. They really didn't want him to like win every time. And a uh, big part about that was that he was just running... Well, he was doing better on everything than everybody, but he was running better offense. He was he was using a lot more bombs than most other people or other people. So they are very high risk, high reward offense. That it has pretty high requirements. But even if you meet the requirements, if you pick it against the wrong matchup, then it's like an instant loss and you can't even slowly win that fight. But you can get some 30 second wins against, not even 30, you can get like 10 second wins against some top teams sometimes. Oh my god, did I drop out of plot again? What the... Dude, my defense is just getting farmed. And, uh, like I said, there isn't really anything that I can do. I mean, 
I could put my own Armands in my defense, but every single person that has has a lockout or Armands in Platinum is gonna be faster than me, so. It, it might deter some people, but I think most people are just gonna call my bluff and the fights are gonna be faster than what I have right now, but maybe next week I will put Armands in instead of Ankara and we'll see the difference, but I'm kind of guessing it's gonna be worse than this, or I'm, I did try it before, to be fair, but it's been uh, a while. Maybe like a month or two ago. Damn, are we even gonna fi finish plot today? It's rough. Damn, we're okay. We're not gonna do it. We're so many points below platinum. Holy moly! Even, even though we haven't gotten any like losses in offense, really. Maybe I can do it if I get like a couple fast fights, maybe one win in defense, but it's not gonna be safe at this point. Uh, which one are we gonna get? Wait, what? Did I A1? I okay, I misclicked, so I think. Okay, th this is a fast one, good. I mean, I have explained this video before, but, uh, oh my god. Yeah, I, I want to look at the defense. Do I, do I want to hit the Ursuko team? I think I can do it with Narsus. I want to look at the defense lock, but I can't do it right now during the reset. I'll do it afterwards. But damn, I'm getting hit so much in my defense. Holy moly. But yeah, I mean... Basically, the point of this team is just to buy some time with Armands and one-shot them with Narsus and Lydia is just there for the... like the passive with block revive and basically nothing else to try to make the fights as fast as possible. Yeah, that one was a really fast one, but... I'm getting... yeah, there's one minute left. Unless I get like two defense wins, it's over, but let's at least get one final win in offense. Are we just gonna... I wanna take a 10 point opponent. Okay. Fuck. Okay. I don't know, I don't think we can make this one in time. I think we got like 40 seconds, so... We need to fall out of this. Oh good, he doesn't... Yeah, he doesn't have stolen skin. We dropped so much, even though we were doing good in offense. That now this is like a very, I guess, weak defense team to be fair. Yeah, it's like 10 second battle. Wait, can we do one more? Maybe not. One. Okay, no, that's... Okay, no. Everything has a lockout. Okay, I don't think we made that today. <laughs> the re issue isn't that my offense, I'm just getting hit so much. But yeah, I guess that kind of ties down to what I was talking about talking about early on in the video that um, I'm not really able to make a good defense team in the meta. That's how it is for many other people too and like I said everybody is using a speed threat in defense. Okay, did we make it? I don't, yeah I don't think so. Okay, I want to see how much did I get hit in defense. That's kind of interesting to see. One, two, three, Wait, wait, now I overcounted this. Okay, I think that was like 18 hits in 30 minutes. Um, I have been, I mean, this kind of, this amount of attacks is not... If, if I were to get a lot of wins, it wouldn't be terrible. But if I get like 10 losses in row after like last 5 minutes or whatever, then it obviously is going to be ISO, and as you can see, I'm mostly getting farmed by the Narcissus offense, some variation of the same thing that I'm using, so... 
We actually did beat the bomb team, that's kind of funny. I wasn't even like hit... I don't think... Yeah, I wasn't even hit by any mad people. But... Um, and the offense went good, I just got, got hit too much, my defense <laughs> wasn't able to deal with it today. Yeah, we were kind of high up at one point, I think I was like 150 or rank 100, and then I just uh, <laughs> I just got hammered in defense. I guess pushing earlier wouldn't have been a better option, like I was kind of uh, going back and forth if, it, if I should have pull, pushed a little bit more or not. I mean, okay, maybe it would have because I dropped out, but maybe if I pushed a little bit less, then it would have been even better, like... Maybe even 10 minutes less, that might have been the best, but... Okay, I mean... I guess I have to... Um, I mean, I'm not confident that my Armand is faster than any of these people's or their lockout, but... I guess that's the only way that I can maybe scare some of them. I definitely can't beat any of those with um, any defense that I might be able to pull, uh, pull out. I mean, if they hit me with this kind of old school offense teams, I guess I can beat them, but basically anybody that ran Narciss against me with Armands or something like that, lockout, then I lost, so. Wait, did, did we already lose the log? No. Okay, let's collect our gold towards. Um, I can't recall what, when's the last time that. I got gold when I was actually pushing platinum. Hasn't been any time recently. I, I think it's like years ago, but I don't remember. But definitely has happened to me a couple times. I remember with rats when we were pushing like three years ago. When this used to happen, we were always super bummed about it. Because back in those days, it wasn't super consistent for me to finish platinum sometimes i could get top 50 sometimes i would finish gold but um for the last couple of years i generally always finish platinum but as you can see in this meta my defense just doesn't hold up but th th this has been an ongoing issue that's not really like um i don't really have any other good ideas apart from just running Armands instead of um, Ankara, I guess, but the Duchess is totally out of the meta as well, I mean, Ankara is ignoring Duchess passive, Duchess is basically useless, nobody is running Duchess or Necret anymore, both of them have been made unviable because of Narcissus offense, and those two were my two main champions that carried my defense, so obviously my defense is going to be way worse than it used to be, but yeah, th this is not good. I really need to pull some primals, a Sifi, something like that. I mean, at this point, if I were to get a Sifi, I wouldn't probably even run Duchess in my defense. Well, I might run both of them, or then I will just run Sifi with Armands, but yeah. I mean... It Rotos isn't ideal, but at least I have him in stone skin, so he isn't instantly getting one shot by Armands, but... Anyway, that's it for today's Platinum push. It's a little bit weird one, because I didn't get even Platinum, but the offense was still solid, even though we got hammered in defense. And one thing that people often ask about me during the plat push videos is my builds. Uh, and I always generally show them at the end, but since I'm talking live, there's no need to do it. I have a link to my Hell Hades optimizer in the description of all of my videos. You can see all of my builds there, not just the items, but like the roles, clips and masteries. You can see ho the whole package and then multiple champions or any of my champions. So it's much easier to look it from there, but... You can, you can join my Discord, you can ask there if you got any additional questions. And you can of course 
like, comment and subscribe to my channel to help me help me get more views and so on. But that's it. Thanks for watching and see ya.